Paul's pity, and he didn't choose to be put on that planet. So we're here to talk about the biggest story going on right now in Hollywood, mm -hmm. sexual predators, Kevin Spacey. Have we seen a fall from grace like Kevin has experienced over the last week, week and a half? It's pretty unprecedented, but if I had to come up with some person, I would come up with Mel Gibson, a very public arrest by a police officer, uh, under the influence, very uh, disrespectful of that police officer. Subsequent recordings of him being incredibly abusive to his then partner. Uh, it took, what, a decade, a decade and a half for people to finally hire Mel back and, and offer a, a, an olive branch to him. But I think this is quite a different case because we're talking about serious criminal charges. If they're, if they're laid, in fact, um, I think right now, in the short term, his career is done. What happens to House of Cards? They've Netflix fired Kevin Spacey, what do you think the outcome is now? Well, I'm really hopeful because it's actually a very well-produced, well-written show that uh, they may do spin-off or do the final season that's pending with Robin Wright Penn or um, Michael Kelly, who plays his right-hand man on the show. They're both worthy of um, attention on a show of their uh, on this show. Uh, they've got great storylines they could pursue on both characters, so maybe that's what will happen. So we see maybe Frank Underwood, Kevin Spacey's Frank Underwood killed off. Yeah, I mean, wouldn't I mean that actually be an incredible turn of events to have an assassin assassination of a president on that show. Um, I think kind of spiritually we would probably mind not seeing it right now. It's, it's, it's a horrible thing for me to say, but it's kind of true. Um, and I think too that people will, will want to watch that show, won't mm -hmm. they? They'll, they'll tune in to see that show. What about the idea of Kevin James, there's a petition, <laughs> Kevin James, 20,000 signatures to take over I on think, House of Cards. I think someone's having a good time with that uh, petition. Um, I don't think he has a hope in hell of being cast in that role, but I mean, you might as well find some level t levelty in what's happening right now in Hollywood because it's pretty depressing, What the stories that are coming up daily, if not hourly. What about the rest of Kevin's projects? Kevin Spacey had Gore, which was a Netflix movie. They're not going to release it. He had Billionaire Boys Club. And he's got all the money in the world that's opening in December, or at least supposedly opening in December. Well, I think these aren't movies, correct me if I'm wrong, that are going to make a lot of money in, in, in Hollywood money talks. I think, you know, they could just come and go like a lot of other films do, uh, release them very quietly and not worry about any Oscar uh, campaign whatsoever. Well, there's certainly going to be a lot more on this story, as yeah. well as what happens to House of Cards, Absolutely. what happens to the rest of Kevin's mm -hmm. projects, and what his future might mm -hmm. be. For Jane Stevenson and Post Media, I'm Mark Daniel.